channel. Hi everybody, thanks for joining me today. I am super pumped about this video. Obviously my cat is too, this is Choi. Um, I need to wait for people to get here, but if you're going to watch back, hi, how are you? Kitty Valentine here, and I will be doing a video I have not, stop, that I haven't really done before, is styling my bag, uh, or a brand new bag, a lot of my bags, I haven't gotten a new bag, well, this is a total lie, I got a new bag for Christmas, I love purses, bags, and I love them to be functional as well, so when you get here, let me know, Troy is giving all the love, so if you shake, that's why, but, um, the bag that I will be styling is, again, a, um, an Italian leather bag. You, know, you guys know, a lot of you may know that I personally am obsessed with Italian leathers. So, that will be something that I will do today. But, I'm going to give you all a minute to get here. This is the one I used today. Um, you guys helped me choose this crochet. This is um, an Addix bag. It's a Norwegian, I believe. Um, beautiful. It went well. Hi, Tanai. How are you? I can't wait to share my new bag. This is not it, but it's that over there, and I can't wait to style it for Valentine's um, for February. I'm well, thank you. I just got back from the store from getting this bag. Um, I was stuck between a couple of purses, but I wanted to give an update on how this bag went because I haven't used this one for work before until today and it went really well. Um, I definitely will use it again, but I've had my eye on a new purse. You texted me um, to Instagram? Okay, I'll check it out, Danae, and we can tell, or Danae, and I will, um, we can uh, chit chat about, you know, mental health and stuff. Totally here for you. Okay, girl. Um, I guess we'll get right into it because I personally want people to watch this. So if it's too long, um, I don't think they will. So um, this is an Addix leather bag. It's an oldie but a goodie. Um, more new to me. But this is why I carry my masks in. It has this beautiful zip. I don't have anything in the front. And I literally can just throw my stuff in there like this. So let's take all my stuff out because I think I want to switch bags and stuff too because I am that type. And got my planner. Okay, so I literally for Valent like for February I have pink and white. Um, red, pink, and white are my colors. Um, that may switch in a moment. Got my lippies. Got my <laughs> I got a diet coke. <laughs> Because your girl needs a little pick-me-up sometimes. Got my Marc Jacobs bronzer. Got my sanitizer. We're taking everything out of here because I couldn't be more excited. I got a couple of now leaders. This bag um, was a great of great use today. Um, and my new bag is very much similar in shape, but a little lighter. So I'm going to move my attics. And I'm going to show you guys what I got today before I start styling it. Um, let me move this stuff. It's kind of an eyesore. I really need to redo my desk, too. Okay, so my new bag is this beautiful, white, glossy leather Italian bag. This is real leather. I will not buy non-leather bags anymore. It's just, that's just my stuck-upness, I guess you could say. Um, this is a bag that I've had my eye on for many years. The only thing I'm a little weirded out, no, it is, because it's, yeah. These handles remind me of my Louis Vuitton handles, that the fake one, but my Louis Vuitton ones don't bend like this that's how you can kind of check and see if it's leather is how pliable it is so let me show you guys this is the front of the bag as you can tell i have a favorite shape it's usually a satchel or like a i like a larger bag i was stuck between um this one and a different shape but i went for this one because as y'all know i like to put a lot so this is the white net 
It's made in Italy and is a genuine leather. Denai says, I'm so happy today because my boyfriend comes back home after one year of being away for his university. <gasps> That's so exciting. Congratulations, sweetheart. That's amazing. I'm very happy for you. Um, so this is a very glossy but yet pliable leather bag. It has gold hardware and it has this nice um very simple uh pop of color which is like a pinky red it's a dark pink or red so i'm going to try and style this bag accordingly for february and what i love about this bag is that i can use it any time of the year really i've never owned a white bag before like a leather white bag so it's a little risky on my end but this will be easy to clean up um so it's made in italy it's a genuine leather this is the brand arcadia handbags and accessory it's original by arcadia of um srl italy designed and made in italy y'all know how obsessed i am with italian leather so our handbags combine the time honored art of expert craftsmanship with the luxury of italian leather and i'm telling you you may not think a glossy bag would smell good. You are on the way, sugar. Oh, my goodness. Ah, there's a reason why we're mermaid kitty here. Um, I'm a mermaid, and I have lots of kitties. Are you going to take over? What are you doing? Stop. <laughs> I just got home, so they're like, okay, are you going to feed me? Are you going to love on me? What's the deal? Troy, honey, you got to get down. When we got our first litter of kitties, I named all the kittens after Lost Cities. The cat munches the bag. I would cry. <laughs> this bad boy was expensive. Um, it's not as expensive as, you know, you know, a uh, higher end. This is a very good quality bag. It is a high end bag, but it's not like the highest end. So I haven't even looked inside really. I just kind of knew I was going to get it. I got this from TJ Maxx for $149.99 where the original price is $260. So one of the reasons why I love Italian brand... Oh, God, dog it, dude. Meow, kitty. Ugh. One of the reasons why I love Italian brands is because um, they're not going to charge you out the ass normally. Um, they're fairly priced. I do save my tags except for the price tags. I got this from TJ Maxx. Um, they had, by the way, at TJ Maxx, you guys, if you're looking for like a cheaper Valentine's bag, but it looks great still and is large, they had Betsy Johnson Valentine's bag. So they had like a really cute, I almost got one, but you know, I, I wanted real leather. So like um, they had like hearts and they had a lot of really cute red bags. Would you stop? You're driving me nuts. <laughs> stop it. I don't know why my cat loves plastic, but it's so dangerous for them. Oh, this is going to be one heck of a video, you guys. Okay, anyway, let's get into this. So, um, let's look inside if Troy will let us get down. Okay, so I'm really excited because I haven't looked. Um, it does have a shoulder strap uh, because this is a briefcase type bag. It's all crunched up. I was sad. I think someone may have bought this once before or something I no, maybe yeah I think so because usually they have these straps wrapped up in the bag but all the plastic's still on it so maybe the person before was just trying out the strap to see how it fit I don't know it's it's connected so maybe not I personally with higher end bags I would suggest to the company to make sure everything's like really well wrapped but you've got this beautiful light tan almost like the undyed leather and it is super soft and it has that wax that red wax on the side which i love and that seems to be a common signature with a lot of italian brand bags i can tell they use a lot of red so it does have an adjustable strap with the gold hardware you've got arcadia here you've got the two beautiful claws so this will hold up nicely um again just like my other italian bag i probably won't use this because you know the black one i showed yesterday 
a beautiful croc print that was super soft. Um, it has the same kind of hooks here. Um, and with my bag being heavy, I don't, I don't want to pull it out. So these aren't really great for crossbodies, but really great for holding by these straps. So let's, I'm so excited. I haven't looked inside. So it looks like this guy zipper comes out like this like my Michael Kors satchel does. So it can really <gasps> open up. Wow, that bad boy is huge. I didn't expect it to be. I should have got another one. <laughs> um, anyway, let's get the paper out. Oh, that is white inside. I don't know. I'm a little nervous about that. Look at that. That is super white. That is like, this is not cream, you guys. That is straight up white. Something about my Facebook account. Someone's trying to get into it or something. Um, anyway. Let's pull it out. So that does make me a little nervous. I'm just going to have to make sure everything's in bags. So let's take a look inside. Woo! -hoo -hoo. That is a spacious mama. Look at her. So what's great about this bag is that if I do decide to switch to larger size planners, I'm good to go. This will hold an A5 for sure. I honestly should have probably gotten the smaller version, but that's okay. I, I love a good big bag, so I didn't get to look at it on me. Hold on. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's okay. It looks just fine in my hand y'all can't see yet okay i'll show y'all though um i've got black and white on today so it'll look nice um okay so let's get started so you have they're just two open pockets and then this zip separated this is like a basic briefcase style it seems and then i've got two pockets here and a zip here this is very common with a lot of the bags that i do get um which in a way I'm kind of thinking, like I said, I should have gone for the other one. It was a little more classic shape. This is literally work bag. Uh, anyway, if that's the case, the other one was cheaper. I could have probably go back and exchange it. But here, could you stop, Kitty? Here's Arcadia Made in Italy. If you want to check out their site, ArcadiaBags.com. Stop it! You're not helping! Y'all, I do apologize. Um, if you don't like animals, like this is not the place for you because my cats photobomb everything. Get down, baby. And if I if I take him out of here, he will cry and cry and cry. So let's try and style this bad boy. So there are a couple of other things that I got while I was there. I'm definitely going to leave the strap. I'm surprised it doesn't have a dust bag. I was really hoping it did. Most of the, my other Italian ones do. Um, I got a new pair of sunglasses. I got these. These are Jessica Simpson. I love Jessica Simpson sunglasses. Um, I only have two pairs. I used to have like 25, 30 pairs, but I um, gave them all away because I was downsizing and I was really going more minimal. But the pair that I do have is officially like torn up. So it was time for a new pair. So I got like this cute cat eye. And of course it's like the gold and the, this is like a brown. I love it. Tortoise. So I got that. That's going to look really nice. Okay. And they were like uh, $9.99 or something. I got another moleskin notebook because I was talking about that. Um, so there, if you are a fan of Juicy Couture, they have a bunch of Juicy Couture stuff right now at TJ Maxx. So um, they have some different ones like this, but... It is a heart, and I love that, and I love that it's like a heart keychain, so I'm super excited about having this. They had a black one, a tan one, um, and a maybe blue one, I think, but I liked the black and this one, so I may go back and get the black one for other days, who knows, but it's just, it unzips like this. It's going to hold a lot because of the zipper. It unzips all the way so you can really get in there so you have this white and black interior um i got this keychain for 9.99 it's originally 14 dollars 
And then you have the Juicy Couture. Well, actually, originally it's $39. Mm, right? Um, this is the Romantic Rose Black. So, um, originally it's like $39. Bucks, but I was able to get it for $9.99. So, there you have it. So, let's get this stuff off. Because I was thinking of hanging it here maybe. But I almost feel like that cheapens the bag a bit. What do you guys think? Give me your thoughts. I don't have like a pink, I don't have a pink or red bunny. I don't really have a Valentine's S keychain or thing to decorate the bag. So that's why I got this. But I won't be taking this back for sure because I really like it. I highly suggest y'all hitting up TJ Maxx for purses and stuff. That's normally where I get my stuff at on Amazon. So I'm taking all the tags off. Um, but before I kind of style things, I may just stick it in the bag. We'll see. Okay, one of the other things I got was this pink card holder. I've been wanting a card holder for quite some time, and this is real leather. This was $12.99. It's real Safiano leather. It's originally $48. And my favorite part is this. I love the fact I turned it over and I love the fact that it was a kitty with sunglasses. So I couldn't resist. This is by, this is also another great brand, especially when their tags are made of cloth, like, or, or really high end string. Like that's how I know it's a great brand. Um, I don't know if I'm too familiar with the brand now this is not a keychain at all it's literally just a card holder and that's what i wanted um this is carl lag lager legend film and it's from paris so that's cool i thought it was cute and it'll go with the whole vibe i'm going for okay last but not least is this calvin klein scarf it matches the Juicy Couture Roses. Now, this is a fairly large scarf, but I was kind of hoping maybe to figure out a way to make it work on my bag. So I need to like somehow manage. It's very soft. It is from Calvin Klein. I spent $12.99 on it. And it originally is 44 so I really lucked out on that. <clears throat> Excuse me, so let me take, I do love scarves, and I wanted, I wear them in my hair often, so I'm losing people. I'm so sorry. Okay, let me take my jacket off so I can focus. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> now, um... I may keep, I ha already have my stuff in like a pink and white bag, so I can literally leave my stuff as is. I do have a red and white polka dot bag as well if I wanted to pull the red out more. But a lot of this is more pink, so I'm going to cut these tags off. I think I'm just going to keep this sucker. It is a beautiful bag. And I like to keep my tags, so hang on. Let me see if I can just pull this out. Yeah, I can. a lot more people yesterday. Maybe I was too late today. Good. I know YouTube has been kind of messing with the uh, people's stuff. Like, um, how do I explain? Okay, anyway, so I'm going to leave this together like this. And this will go into the bag okay so let's see how do you do you guys know how to like wrap handles oh i didn't see that y'all been talking to me i'm so sorry i texted you as if so have a little the cat munches the bag no she's so cute and beautiful great choice thank you she is a big girl but she's perfect because if i want to move into an a5 which i need to talk to y'all <laughs> kind of want to it would be a good choice. So let's see. Do y'all know how to wrap? Oh, I don't know how to wrap. Um, 
Dude, you're not helping. So would I wrap one, maybe one handle? This is real leather, so I want it to patina properly, but now I apologize. Like, as y'all can tell, he needs he's a miser, so a flame point miser, so he needs a lot of love. And I need to wrap. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. Um, so yeah. Anyway, let's see if I can wrap this sucker should i put it on the front of the bag because i definitely want do i want this on here i don't know oh well thank goodness this is gold too because um that would have looked funny i think i want to take the charm that they had on here off because i'm not actually too fond of this i may use it as like a zipper pull or something Oh, okay, it's stuck on there. It's tied on, so that's good. Oh, and TJ Maxx has a lot of um, things on sale right now, like in the clearance. So, I'm in bags, but I am such a snob, so. Alright, so that, taking that one piece off changes the bag drastically. I think this right here gives the bag something a little more interest. Okay, let's see if we can wrap. I don't know how to do this, so should I do it on the front, though? Because I definitely want this. I love that it's a heart. That's so cute. I really want a puff, can a puff on here, but... Okay. Fold the scarf in half. Okay. Make a loop in one side, and then slide the in inside the loop okay so like a slip knot okay so <clears throat> fold in half make a loop like this wait okay hold on <laughs> all right you said fold in half Oh, oh, I want to wrap it. I actually want to wrap it around the handle because this is a super, super long scarf. So, okay, maybe I can leave the loop out like this. And then, okay, so I'm going to want it to wrap here maybe. I should have watched the tutorial, but I was too excited. I definitely want a lot of the pink to show and the red. What am I doing? I'm so silly. Wait, did I get that right? What'd you say? Hold on. What'd you say? You said, um, fold the scarf in half, make a loop in one side, and then slide the other end inside the loop. So I need to wrap it first then. I do agree with folding it in half because it's such a long scarf. God, this is so silky. Oh, it feels so good. Okay. I'm not sure how I'm going to do this, you guys. I don't want the Calvin Klein to show. Not really. How is this going to work? Like, on either side. How did they... How do people make this work? Um, okay, let's try this. I do like how it looks wrapped. I think that's really pretty. It adds a lot of, let's see. You guys are going to be like, this girl doesn't know what she's doing. And you would be correct. I don't. All right. Fold in half. Check. Okay, so I'm just going to start Calvin Klein in. because, And then I'm going to... Oh, I didn't fold it in half. Crap. <laughs> okay. I'm going to start it here and then make the loop, kind of like you said, I guess. And then pull it here. And 
to like a knot ish so if it wasn't so damn long i would just leave it down but it's really long so um let's see all right so put it here and then here and here I do it and then tie. Tie? Tie? Or I could make a bow. I just, I don't know how chunky a bow would make it. What am I doing? Okay. Oh, my ankle. I'm trying, y'all. Bear with me. So I'd have to seriously tie this a couple of times. It's starting to come undone. Okay, I'll do this. Ugh. was hard okay let's see I don't know if this is gonna stay should I put what do y'all think is that good I know it kind of hides the but I don't mind it I feel like it takes away from a little bit of the tackling there what do you guys think oh Leave just the knot and then make a bow. Okay. There. What do y'all think? Does that look okay? <laughs> Does that look good? This is the back side. So this is the front. I like that. I think that's cute. Um, what do y'all think? Let me cut off this tag right here. Dude, thought you were going to stay away for a little bit. <laughs> Ugh, silly cat. You guys like that? Dude, can you? Is he cute next to the purse? Isn't he cute? Get out of here. I love you. I love you. I love you. I did it. What do you guys think? Does that look cute or not? Look. Question. Come on now. Sorry, my, my thing is giving me a hard time. Should I move this guy to this side? I kind of like it the way it is, I think. Yeah, we're going to leave it the way it is. Yeah, it's cute. Okay. Thank you. Hi, you're the best. All right, let's get my little wallet stuff in here because I'm finally... Made a choice, a conscious choice to, I love using that cat, the white kitty, his name is Troy. He's like such a baby. 
I'm going to stick my cards in this. I thought this looked kind of cute. I mean, black obviously looks nice too. If I really want to keep it chic looking, I guess I could. What do you guys think? I just bought this sucker. Should we go cute and pink or should we go like straight up just chic and black? I think I just, I bought this sucker. I'm using it. And I'm going to move, I'm going to start using more cards. Y'all are going to hear my cat cry. I'm just going to tell y'all that now. He is such a needy little guy. I have cash right now, but it's all going to bills <laughs> soon. So, um, I got a lot of cards. So, um, what I'm doing is taking out my cards. Oh, and Juicy Couture also has um, a card thing, but it had a zipper up here, and I didn't like how it was made. It was kind of weird. I didn't really like the way it was made. Um, yeah. Okay. Put my main card in the front. I can't show y'all putting my cards, you know. Cute and pink. Okay, perfect. I'm so glad you agreed with me. I might as well leave my Lane Bryant card here because there's not one here anymore. And I'm so depressed about that. And then I've got my TJ Maxx card. And I've got my AAA card, which is super important. <laughs> and I got my training, my my first stuff. My medical card and car insurance. Ooh, this is supposed to be easy to get into, right? Yeah, I'm putting stuff in here. I've never used a card thing like this before, but I see why people like it because it's very compact, but I also don't understand it because this is hard to get into. Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay, here it is. Yay, it's so cute and it has my, make sure my stuff, okay. Got my two main cards here and then my two lesser cards here and then cards in the middle, super tight. It's a shame it's not a keychain. Okay, the whiskers are coming undone here. Look. That's fine. That's fine. I will fix them. I will. <gasps> Look, it's coming really seriously. Fucking ass. I spent money on this. Oh, well. Safiana leather, really cute and pink. Perfect for Valentine's Day. And, of course, my planner is decked out. Um, I'm in the Foxy Fix. I don't think y'all saw this. There she is. There's my Valentine's planner. Okay. So there she is. Ugh, this stinking thing. Y'all are gonna be like, this is the worst drive ever. I, I need a new um, clip and stuff. Hang on, I'm so sorry. Okay, hang on. So, it's starting to look cute. I'm really, really liking it. What do you guys think? Okay, here we go. There, that's better. God, he is, he is here. <gasps> girl, go see him. Don't even stay here. Go, go, girl, go. Run to him. Run to him. Okay, so I have this pink pouch, um... Those of you that helped me out the other day or last night know that I put everything in these two pouches. So I, I like that they go. They're white and pink. And then um, I got some money I need to take out here. Hold on. Money. I don't have an actual wallet for money. So, I guess I could, I mean, I just, you know, I'll figure out what to do with that. And then, this is my work notebook, so, you know. and then, two lippies. This is the pen case I've been using. Now, before, everybody, before we decide um, if I want to put these two in here, I think I may say match, and they just go, so, well, this is my mask. Thing, but I don't have to. I got a new one. Never mind. <laughs> I was like, this does not match. Hold on. Let me get my clean mask out. I used the other one today. 
see if it'll fit in here. It should. Boom. Perfect. My mask. Okay. And I think I have my bear on my keys. This is a luggage tag. This will look cute on. Oh my god, that looks cute on my bag. <gasps> Does that not look cute on here? Oh no. No, I'm not gonna do that. Alright, let's fill I have one more option. Hold on, guys. I have another option for bags, like for inside the purse. I need your opinion. Okay, I also have this one. What do you guys think? Should I go red and white polka dot? It also has roses on it. And I could honestly fit everything that's in these two probably in this one. Because it's humongous. Should I do that? Or should I do these two pouches? What are your thoughts on this? Because I like them both. Should we go red? Or should we go pink and white? Someone tell me something. White and pink or red? I've got a pink card holder. My nails are pink. Let's let's try the red because I really wanted to pull some red into my bag. So let's do that. I'm literally gonna dump everything in here. So leave the bags you already have. Oh, what are you still doing here tonight? You have you have a your man, right? What you doing? You should be like going to see him. He said he's here. Um, they're much better. Okay. What I'm going, I think they're classier for sure. I do want to see though how much can fit in here. I'm just curious if I can fit everything in this one bag. I said that I probably could. So I'm just, I'm just literally curious if I can. Okay. I don't think so. I have a lot of stuff in here. Oh, yeah, I ended up carrying extra makeup. Pink! Don't worry, I'll go back to the pink and red. I mean, pink and white. I'm just curious. I think everything will fit in here. Let's see. The pink! Thank you! Okay, don't worry, I'll go back to the pink. I'm literally just doing this because I'm curious. To see how much can fit in this red and white purse, like, bag. I agree with the pink, too. Wow, this thing holds everything. <laughs> like, it holds a lot. Woo! Yeah, I don't like the look of that as much as the pink and white. So we're going to go back to the pink and white. Thanks for helping me out, y'all. Let's see. Um, I need to rethink which bag goes, which thing goes in what here. Okay, this... Dove. Um, I've got my dry shampoo, my lint roller, my makeup wipes, my tissues, my deodorant, um, and the pink. And I think I'll have something else. I have my, I'll have my hair ties and my hair brush in the pink. This is holds my hair stuff, like my bobby pins and things like that. And then I have a miniature wet brush. I have short hair, so it works for me. And then in the white, we'll just put, like, all the other things. I have band-aids, um, cleaning, my Melody Cleaning Wipe, my vitamins, my nail file, Vaseline. I've shown this pretty often. My Nung Champa, um, a couple of... Mazooka Honey um, Cough Drops, Michael Kors, Eyelash Glue for when I wear them, um, Tranquil from Young Living for headaches, Nail Glue, 
lotion, Tums, tweezers, because I use those for like stickers too. Mirror. <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Um, a small concealer from Kat Von D. My NYX lippies and one of my Jeffree Stars. And this is my coin pouch. So bye, red bag. Don't need you. Um, so in here, I'm also going to throw my um, Fit Me, my eyeliner. I've got an on-the-go eyeshadow from Kat Von D, which I've been using a lot recently. I've been doing a very simple makeup. Glowy, but simple. Wow, that all fits. It's amazing. I'm going to stick my this guy into this one. Although, actually, no, I could probably put him in the purse. So, okay, we're back here. Let's take off the... I have yet to take the plastic off this because these are brand new when I decided to use them. So, I'm going to lift those off. Some plastic here, too. Nice. And I love that these have gold hardware as well as well new purse who dis <laughs> i know right hi chastity oh and hi kaylene how are you doing sweetie um yeah i just got it today um it's for february and beyond and i just <laughs> struggled to put this on one of the handles and i added this is for my mask um yeah do you guys like it i it's to be real with you, it's totally not my normal style. Like, I'm more of, like, a earth-toned black and brown type. But I love this bag. And I've seen this uh, Italian brand before. And as I mentioned many times, I'm all Italian brand. I love it. I'm actually going to stick my money. This is for bills, but I'm going to stick it in here. And I have some change I need to add in here. Because concession tomorrow for the kiddos. I need to get some dollar bills. I have a stash. Okay. So I'm going to be filling this up to... Really, I wonder if I have like a cute moment. Anyway, let's fill up the bag. What do you guys say? You down? You ready? You ready for it, girls? Oh, I haven't shown y'all this before. But I think it's pretty cute. Oh, I have a couple things I'll show you. Okay, so this is a perfume, a Japanese perfume. I love it. It smells so good. And they're collector items, and I cannot find them. Like, they're super expensive on when you can find them. But isn't she cute? Wouldn't she be cute to go in here? Not that I need a whole perfume in my purse, but I mean, this is for the vibe, right? And then look at this pouch. <laughs> aren't they the cutest i'm not gonna put them in there i don't i have other stuff in here but yeah it's totally cute Let's see. i need to get an eyeglass case or a sunglass case i don't have one okay let's fill her up you guys so this is what i have when it comes that time of month then i'll add my little you know thingamabobber so, new purse, who dis? That's so funny. I mean, my stuff's so organized, too. I love it. So, again, just for those of you just now coming, look how big this business is. <laughs> I can fit everything in here. I should have gotten the smaller one, I think. No. All right. So, we're going to put... I mean, I can stand these girls up, too, like this. I like to do that. I like to have, like, a filing system in my purse. I know that sounds insane. <laughs> this is literally all I have. Okay. I'm going to stick my coins back here. Perfect. Ooh, it's perfect height. And then I've got my cute falling apart already kitty. Wow, that is so, it is, it's super luxurious, um, I did spend pretty penny, but it wasn't so bad, um, it was a hundred, at TJ Maxx, $149.99, but, um, price aside, it's an arcade, it's a leather 
Italian leather, Arcadia, made in Italy. I love Italian brand bags. They're more affordable than like the higher end things, um, but more luxurious in my mind. So a lot of my purses um, are from Italian. So I'm in a smaller planner nowadays. So it's kind of funny that I got such a big bag, but I'm kind I'm like living for it. So it's okay. Um, I got my little card thing. So I'll stick her here. If it'll let me. <gasps> I don't like some of the stitching. This. Okay, I'm going to tell you now. I don't like the lining of this. Um, I really don't. But anyway, money's there. Um, it's it's a, It'll be easy to clean. I mean, I guess you would have to have an easy to clean lining in order to have such a white cloth I could literally wipe this down but um it is a great bag though and it has this middle I don't even have enough stuff to put in here now which is good because I won't be too heavy I don't even want to put this in here oh yeah I have a pencil case pencil pouch that stick her in there <laughs> Like, I want to see her. So, you know, to me, the inside of the bag should look just as pretty as the outside. I just, I'm mean, that type, I guess. So, we're going to actually, boom, shut up, boom, maybe do this. But the only thing about that is you want to put the taller things in the bag. So, what if I, you know what, no, I'm just going to do what I did. I'm just going to do this. I can do one there, one here. There we go. Uh -oh. yeah. Sorry about that. Um, I, it's probably gonna be call back pretty quickly. So, um, and my work planner. I know this is so tiny, but it's okay. I could always go for my A5 one that has a white cover stick that in the front if I do this yes can y'all see I'm sorry it's just I got a lot of room in here this is my pen pouch I got the whites in the back pinks in the front um and that's literally everything right now um Look, if I want to take a whole box of chocolate, let's see if it'll fit in here. What? What? Yeah. Sorry. Oh, yeah. I do have my sanitizer. And I... Let's see. Right here. Right here. Back. Now, I don't want it to be, like, poofy. I want to keep it slim, so I think I may not do that. This is... You got to play around. I know I do. Okay, so we're going to actually stick this back here. No, we'll keep this up front and then stick sanitizer here. Like this, I guess. Alright, let's zip her up. Let's see. Who is this? Who is this? Alright, so she is zipped and ready and beautiful. Beautiful. I really like how it turned out. Um... Okay, so I don't have a cloth on the back, which is fine. She distributes the weight pretty fairly, evenly. It depends on how you put your stuff. Um, it's a little heavier on this side because I have both pouches on this side. But it has a strap out here that you can tuck in if you want. It does have a crossbody, which I will not use because it. my bags are always so heavy. But... I may. If I keep it short, but I'm going to have to flatten it. I'm going to have to work with this. It is an undyed leather, so it will patina over time. So I could see myself using it as like a, a shorter strap, maybe. But definitely not a longer strap. Uh, I'm going to have to work with that. It's pretty ugly right now. So, yeah, there's 
my new bag. What do you guys think? Do you like it? Um, I can't really see it. You guys like it? Uh, I think I'm gonna have to get used to the super girliness of it, but I really wanted that. So, ta-da! Let's see what y'all say. How did that bag work today at work? Okay, okay. Um, I said it at the beginning of this video, but I actually filmed for you guys at work, and I'll post it. Um, it works really well. Um, I will definitely use it again. It looked nice. It felt great. The straps are so strong and comfortable that I could stick it on my shoulder and, or in the crook of my arm, and it just was so good. Um, it carried everything well. I was even able to like throw like my lunch in there and zip it up and it was amazing. So I highly suggest an addict for sure. Um, I love all the floral and the floral heart patch, Anna Marie. Thank you. I did not know if I would like this, but against this beautiful white leather, glossy leather, I think it's beautiful. This is a Ralph Lauren, um, scarf and it was super, super long. So, um, I just folded it in half and tied it and wrapped it thanks to one of the kittens helping me out. This is a Juicy Couture pouch, which um, had they had different colors, but I really wanted the floral for, you know, February. Plus, I think I will definitely use this another time, too. But this has my mask in it. And it does have gold hardware, so it actually matches the hardware on the bag. But, oops. To be honest, I kind of prefer this. <laughs> yeah. Um, and then again, 12 of y'all are here. I guess they don't put tell y'all when I'm here, like, soon, quickly. So I need to get the plastic off. It has this beautiful, like, heavy zip. It's very, like, heavy. And this beautiful undyed leather. It's just so smooth. Um, I thought at first it wasn't real leather. I was like, what? But no, it is. It is. Um, this is real leather because it's pliable. If it weren't, it wouldn't be pliable. Um, and this brand is known for its genuine leather handmade bags. So this is what it looks like on the inside. The only eyesore I have is that green notebook right there. So if I really wanted to, I could change it out. Or um, one of my little white ones, which to be honest, I may actually do <laughs> and stick it back here. <laughs> I could actually do that, but um, there you have it. It's very simple and easy. Got my pen pouch, my makeup, uh, my makeup and other stuff, and then hair stuff, just touch ups, and then my money stuff. I just can't get over this sucker. He is just so cute. <laughs> I never have owned one of these things, but I see why people like them. They're they're really slim and easy. So, and you can stick it in a wallet if you want it. And then, there's my bear. So, that's it. That is all. Um, do you guys have any other questions? I will do an updated, like, um, or I never, yesterday I did kind of like a purse uh, stash. Just kind of happened. But I'll actually make um, a live base on just my bags and um, go through. But I guarantee you I'm going to end up buying another bag. I'm just a bag freak and I've gotten rid of so many. And I'm ready to rebuild my stash for all leather bags. Like just all leather. <laughs> so I'm going to go, you guys. I have to cook dinner. Oh, yeah, I forgot to add my sunglasses. I don't have a case for this. I looked for a case at TJ Maxx, but they didn't have them. So that was super frustrating. So I've got to figure out a way or something for this because I'm not about to mess up my Jessica Simpson. I don't want to mess these up. I have, These are my only pair. My other ones did get messed up. So, so yeah, super ready i don't know what kind of, i'm wearing a black and white outfit right now oh yeah i need to show you my opd hold on <laughs> uh i actually cleaned a little bit last night uh <laughs> i actually got my purses all lined up and stuff and then i bought this and now i have stuff everywhere again so 
Let me see. Hold on. Give me a second. All right. Let me show y'all what it looks like against my body. My cats are just crying. I'm so sorry. So, uh, yeah. It's kind of blurry. I apologize. So, against my curvaceous body, it's pretty large still, but it's still good. There you go. All right, you guys. I love y'all so much. And until next time, bye.